No, I've got a little one that sits on the middle of my pet. Oh. Uh -huh. You can ring me up two waters. I am getting batteries, flashlights, uh, tarps, just in case the roof does blow off. I can cover stuff. Um, I would have got a generator, but they're all out. And uh, let's hope for the best and plan for the worst. And and all you can do is try to be prepared and and hope for nothing to happen and go from there. So I definitely uh, this one. I hope the models are wrong. Uh, oh, and get some water too. It's a good deal. Three forty-seven for a case of water. So I'm going to pick up a couple cases of water as well so I'll pick those up on my way out and I hate picking them up they're heavy but I'll get them so we've been preparing for the storm pretty much all week we're making sure that all the merchandise we have in our overheads are down on the floor we're making sure all the, the merchandise that comes in receiving makes it out to the floor as quick as possible our whole staff is dedicated to making sure that we have everything on the floor ready for our customers just in case there is that emergency um, all batteries flashlights tarps anything and everything that you can think of candles Anything you can think of, we have it. Um, we actually sold through all of our generators. Our stores in our area have sold through their generators. Um, it took probably about 30 minutes this morning to sell through about 50 generators. So we've been very busy. We have extra cashiers on staff, a lot of tenants loading customers up. So we're going to do everything that we can for our community and make sure everyone's prepared.